Ladies and gentlemen, in today's video, we'll be opening up 10 Pokemon Celebration ETBs, aka 100 Pokemon Celebration Boosters, to find out how many hits you'd get if you opened up 100 packs of the best set of 2021. But the kicker is, every time we double up on a hit, whether it be like a Charizard or whatever, as long as we double up on it, it's going into a pile, and I'm giving the entire pile away to one lucky comment. Good luck, leave a comment in the comment section below, but most of all, let's get into a hundred boosters of celebrations. Ladies and gentlemen, this right here is officially the Unlisted Leaf Pokemon Celebrations Finale. We are going to open up a hundred boosters and Ando is going to finish the entire set. If we are, uh, if everything goes to plan, my actual recap is going to be me showing off a binder, my official Pokemon Celebrations binder, and hopefully showing you a completed set. That's my one goal for this opening was to sort of go after all the cards that we don't have yet, like the Mega Rayquaza, Tapa Lele, Mewtwo EX, Xerneas EX, and we're kicking it off straight away, Extended Art Pikachu. Now, this is the first pull, so we're gonna put this to the side. Whenever we double up on an Extended Art Pikachu, it's going into the flipping giveaway pile. Already on the first pack, Team Magma's Groudon right there. Heritage card on the first booster. Guys, I know this is going to be a crazy opening. Make sure you do your seatbelts up, but we're going to start putting these uh, to the side. So, whenever we double up on Team Magma's Groudon, I'm going to put it into the uh, giveaway pile. And by the end of the episode, we should have a bunch of double ups, whether that be like multiple Charizards, I don't know, multiple maybe Gold Star Umbreons, whatever. I'm going to give away to one lucky comment. So if you've ever left a comment, make sure already, boom, there's a giveaway card. Make sure you leave a comment in the comment section below. This is going to be an absolutely thrilling ride. You can't, oh my, I bit my lip, I bit my lip. Oh my gosh, I bit my lip on the second booster in. Oh, this sucks so bad. It's, oh, this blood. This literally, ah. Guys, I'm bleeding in the mouth. Oh, that's... I, oh, okay. We've just pulled a Shining Magic up. I kid you not, this is like the third rarest card that you can literally pull. You guys, after my booster box, will like, Ando, if you're gonna open up another flipping, like, Celebrations product, just do a bunch of ETBs. They've clearly shown that they have the best pull rates. Um, and if you're hunting down things like the Ultra Rare, Mega Rayquaza, or like Gold Star, Umbreon, Delta Species, Gardevoir, EX... This is going to be the product that you got to crack open. And you know what? Little Timmy was correct because we are starting off with non-stop bangers. It's legit scary at this point how good the pulls are. We got Dialga. Oh! I don't know what to say. I literally, I'm so detached. Like, my mouth is literally on fire. We've just pulled a base set Venusaur to kick this episode off. This right here, we've pulled this beauty on the third booster pack in. I love you, Venusaur. A Wizards of the Coast reprint. This is like my final homage to the best set of 2021, maybe of all time. And I couldn't think of a better way to kick it off. Base set Venusaur. I really, really pray that we can get another Charizard because I really want one for my binder and then I want to send one off to PSA. And then I'd hope I pull another one because I can give it away to you guys at home. I can't believe we pulled a Venusaur and a Shining Magic up. But guys, it doesn't matter. As much as my mouth hurts, as much as these pulls are literally off the charts right now, we're going to keep it moving because we have a hundred boosters of this to get through. Xerneas and then Dialga. If you've ever liked the video, please let it be this one. Um, it's going to go for a while and I need all the support I can get because uh, I think watch time's terrible on these really long openings, but I don't care. All right, let, whatever. Forget about the code card there. We've got, uh, <laughs> we've got boosters to open up. We got Solgaleo, a Veltal, Cosmog, and then we got a Reshiram. I really don't care about these like normal types of boosters. They don't sort of get me down because I know you've got to have them in order to get the McSpicy Bangarooskies. We're going to go one for the back. Professor's Research looking good. Kyogre, Groudon, and then another regular pack. Okay, let's keep it moving. My mouth is on fire. I can't believe I bit my cheek pulling a Shining Magic up. Like imagine going to the doctor and they're like, Oh, so like, how'd, how'd you do that, Ando? How'd you hurt your mouth? Well, you see, Doc, I was doing an 100 celebration booster pack opening when I bit my cheek off. That's normal, isn't it? What do you think, little Timmy? Okay, Flying Pikachu. Man, I'm gonna have fun sorting out this giveaway pile at the end. I will show you guys what you can win. Um, hopefully show off all the cards. 
It's gonna be a lot of like extended up Pikachus, I think. It's gonna be a lot of like flying Pikachus. Uh, but I mainly just wanted to do this because I wanted to complete my celebration collection. And I thought, if we're gonna do an homage, if we're gonna get Slaparooskies and, and just sort of have a look at this set as an overview, let's open up a hundred, a booster case. Like this is a sealed booster case and find out what the ratio would be. Beautiful surfing Pikachu VMAX right there, followed up by a Claydol. You know what's so funny? I was watching a video, someone's favorite card in the whole set was Claydol. And they were going on the whole video about how much they love this card. It's underappreciated. You know what guys, we're gonna show some love to Claydol. It's a good looking card. Celebrations, it's got the texture. Look at that, confetti everywhere. Shout out to all my Claydol lovers, I do see you. I mean, I probably wouldn't have thought there's that many Claydol fans out there, but apparently there is. So you guys are gonna stop pooping on clay dogs, apparently. Bit of a fan following. So let's keep it going. Mew, this was a tough cookie for me to get for a while. I do remember Palkia and a Dialga. Okay, we're gonna get through these regular ones. That clay doll had a print line down the middle. I didn't see that. That's all right, that's not too bad. Okay. We, <laughs> I haven't got time to be uh, flussing over print lines or getting angry over ratios. We're just gonna see what like a hundred sort of cross section is gonna contain. Um, I think there is a lot of like ratios out on Instagram at the moment. People saying like one in every 200 packs contains this, that, or the other. Oh, no way! Come on! I'm not gonna jump into the Pikachu just yet, but we went and did it, ladies and gentlemen. What a start! I feel like we don't even need to finish the video at this point. I'm overheating. I've just got a legit pulled my first ever Umbreon Gold Star right there. I thought this was going to be the one we're not going to get. I mean, it's up there as like one of the rarest cards in celebrations. And I did it, guys. I already want to start building my binder. If I wasn't recording right now, I would stop everything and go and put this in my binder because the satisfaction of filling up a slot is unreal. Oh, wow. All right, as soon as I double up on this card, I'm giving it away as well, guys. I just wanted to pull one for my binder. Dude, look at that texture. Look at that. Oh. <laughs> Umbreon's one of my favorite Pokemon, so I'm sorry uh, for that freak out, but I haven't pulled this one yet, and it's one of my favorites. That's awesome. Gold Star Umbreon. I mean, now I really need the uh, EX Delta Species Gardevoir. Dude, it's like a red, oh gosh, it read my mind. So Endo, what do you want to pull? Gold Star Umbreon? Okay. Now, I know- Oh! Okay, Flying Pikachu. Don't have too many of these. And again, I'm going to give away all the double ups. VMAX right there. Dialga, Kyogre, Aveltal. <sighs> That's going to be the last one. I think the Mega Aquaza is going to be the toughest one for us to track down. Same with Tapa Lele. For some reason, when I was on Instagram looking at those ratios, Tapa Lele was actually the hardest card to track down. Someone said it took like 216 packs to officially get it, like guaranteed. I've only got 100 packs here, and I would have thought that's more than enough for such a tiny set, but yeah, 216 was like Tapa Lele's official ratio. Beautiful Clefer. Guys, the recap's gonna be awesome. Stay tuned to the end of the video. Neo Clefer right there. We do have quite a few of those. One of the more common sides, so I think we will probably double up and see a few uh, Clefa repeats. And we also got to tidy up the uh, <laughs> the set continuously today so it doesn't get too crowded. But yeah, I reckon that Sapu is going to be hard, that Mega Quaza is going to be difficult. Haven't seen too many Mewtwo EXs either. Let me know in the comment section, have you got any of the cards I mentioned? I know uh, Shining Magikarp, for the amount we've pulled it, it doesn't feel as rare as everyone makes it out to be. Like, people have been tweeting me nonstop, and oh, you're so lucky getting the Shining Magic up. When you did the booster box opening, the fact you got two of them was crazy. Oh, snap, another one. Flying Pikachu V. We are giving away cards left, right, and center. It's gonna be such a good, like, time and video today. Kyogre and the Veltal. Uh, but yeah, I, I feel like, for some reason, that Shining Magic up shouldn't be the fifth hardest card to get. I thought it was the second for ages, but apparently, yeah, the Tapus, the EXs, and that sort of, the end of the set there, the other end, it's actually quite difficult to get all those cards. Here we go, Flying Pikachu VMAX. We're starting to see how easy these VMAXs might be to get out of the ETBs. So we've got Dialga, Palkia, and a Ho-Ho. Not too many cards in each booster pack. Usually when I open up 100, or I think it's like 216 packs out of a booster case, whenever I do my booster case openings, 
They usually take like three hours, maybe two and a half. I'd be curious how many like a hundred, a hundred packs of a four card booster is gonna take. We got Surfing Pikachu. Oh guys, every single card is so good. Like I could stare at all of them for ages. And I think that makes it even better when you buy a regular collection right there. Because you're guaranteed to get good stuff. Imposter Professor Oak. Look at him. Menacing right there. What did he do to the real one? You can see the shadow. Got his hair gel point in both ends. Beautiful card right there. Got the texture and everything. Let's keep it moving, guys. Okay, okay, okay. Let's regroup. Let's regroup. We still got a couple of cards we need to get. We did pull the Umbreon, which is... A very, very good one because I was very worried I wasn't going to get it. And let's go one from the back. I did look up how much the uh, Rayquaza was selling for because I was like, if it's such a hard card to get, like, am I going to have to buy it? It's sitting at about the $84 Australia mark, which is very expensive, I think, for a card that comes out of a set that spits out this many good, like, sort of holes. I haven't looked up prices of too many other cards because I generally don't care. Like, I'm not going to sell it. I'm not doing this. I only looked up that Rayquaza because I was like, if I have to buy it, how much do I going to have to pay? And it is, it's sitting expensive because that's the same price roughly as an ETB. Lukia, ho ho! And another Professor Rogue! So this time, this one's going into the giveaway pile. Congratulations right there. Let's not dwell on it too much. We have already pulled that bad boy. And we're just gonna pop it into the uh, double ups right there. I'll sort those out, show you at the end. Haven't seen too many extended up Pikachus. I would have thought we're gonna see a couple more of those. Maybe as we get further into these boxes. We are seeing a stack of these flying Pikachus though. I feel like after this, you guys are gonna be absolute experts in knowing like what's a common pull in this set. Like when you get something, you're like, oh yeah, that's pretty common or that wow, that's pretty rare. I gotta say though, you notice? Still haven't seen any sort of EX on the heritage end, guys. It's gonna be so hard. If I get Mega Quaza today, I'm jumping in that Pikachu because that's a card I just don't think we're gonna get. Mewtwo EX Tapa Lele. It's weird because I genuinely, I don't care that much about Tapa Lele. But I care so much because I want it for the set, you know what I mean? It's one of those cards where you're like, oh, the Pokemon itself, it's not my favorite Pokemon, but I really need the card in the Celebrations form with that beautiful 25th logo with the Pikachu cheeks right there. Professor, Reshiram, Palkia, and another regular booster right there. Oh gosh, this one's extra sealed up. Could be a good thing, could be a bad thing. Oh, oh wow, oh wow, we've completely thanos this one apart. Okay, there's the code card. I hope you guys are having a Merry Christmas with those code cards. Zacian. Haven't got too many Zacian and Zamazentas, have we? Xerneas and Groudon. Have you noticed though? Look at this. We are burning through this so fast. This is what happens when you go like light speed, I guess. And you got such thin booster packs. Okay, Palkia, put you to the side. Come on, EX pull, guys. Oh, that's what I forgot. Professor's Research Full Art. That's another good one. Stop, stop, stop. How many golden Mews are we going to have? Oh, that's a good question. That's what I'm now thinking. The gold shiny Mew. That was for me? Oh, guys. If you didn't watch my booster box opening, like, watch that before you watch this one. I worked so hard to get that golden Mew. And I reckon... That's actually harder than uh, a lot of things to get. Jeez, I completely messed that booster up right there. Zamazenta, of course, after we get the Zacian. Kyoga, Exernius. Oh, yes! Ladies and gentlemen, you're kidding me! None other than the man, the myth, the legend, Shorazan! Oh, snap! No way! I finally did it! Oh, when you I swear when you're not looking for a card is when it comes out. Look at that! Shorazard again! How many Zards do you think we're gonna get? That's the first one. I really, really want another one for my collection, so that'll be it. And anytime we get a Zard after this, I'm giving it away to you guys. Oh! Yes! Gold Star Umbreon, Shorazard base set. Today can't get any better. Start off with a Shining Magic Up as well. If you haven't liked the video, this right here is the opening of the century. Oh, that confetti style, the texture. Oh boys, let's put this one to the side. Shorazard has been pulled again. Oh my, okay. I don't think I'm gonna have to do another Celebrations opening after this. I think we're gonna do it. I think Uncle Ango can bring this one home. I just gotta be really concentrated on the select few that we need. What do you reckon? Place your bets right now in the video without skipping ahead. Is today gonna be successful? Boom, Pikachu in the giveaway pile. 
Reshiram, Zekrom. Here comes Team Rocket. Gorgeous card out of the Evo uh, sort of set right there. Although, I would probably rather open Celebrations than Evo at the moment, especially after we open that Evolution Booster Box. Oh, the polls, guys. <laughs> the newer print of Evolutions. It really kicked me in the gonads. It wasn't the best. Okay, here we go. Lunala, Lugia, Ho-Ho. There we go. Double up on the Team Magma's Groudon in the giveaway pile. Fantastic! I can't believe today. As if we got another Zard. I think that's red. So, that looks so good, the centering on that Charizard too. I might have to PSA that one. And then the other one's going to stay in the binder. Which I think makes sense for my uh, collection. I also... I oh, The Ultra Premium Collection... Everyone's telling me to PSA grade the metal cards because you can like it came out. Um, that's a giveaway card It came out that you can PSA grade the metal cards. Oh, yes, another one that I need Oh, it's whenever I don't care about pulling a card. I pull it. I need rocket Zapdos Another one's done guys. We're so close to ending this thing. I'm gonna have a complete binder to show off. I swear Holy smokes. Look at that. Look at that. The texture is insane. Ladies and gentlemen, Rockets Zapdos. Dude, that is a gorgeous card. Oh, I can't believe it. Charizard, Rocket Zapdos, Gold Star Umbreon. Today can't get any better. Okay, you ready? Let's put this one to the side. And let's keep it moving. I think, because all, all I need is the Mewtwo EX, Xerneas EX, Megroquaza EX, Tapa Lele GX, and then... I think just the Gardevoir. Let's have a look. I got my little checklist to the side right here. Yeah, all I need is the Gardevoir Delta Species, and I've got every single card out this whole set. So if I can pull those five cards, I will stop and give away the rest of the boosters uh, in, a, in another giveaway. So we'll do two giveaways. How about that? Because I won't need to open up the rest of these packs, and I feel like someone at home can utilize them. And that way, Uncle Ando can say that he's opened up and pulled all the Celebration set himself, like... You could go back through all my videos. Oh, no way! Oh, my gosh! Oh, my gosh! It's going to happen. It's going to happen. Ladies and gentlemen, this is totally doable right now. It's the Pokemon God upstairs. I swear, Arceus is watching, and Arceus is like, well, if you're going to give the packs away, let me just stop you right there. Dude, Tapa Lele GX. We are hunting for four cards right now, and that is it. Tapa Lele GX has been pulled. Okay, seriously, as soon as I find these four cards, I'm giving the rest of the packs away to another comment. So someone's getting all the repeats, someone's getting all the packs. Just leave a comment, and that's it. This has changed the game. I just got to tap a Lele. Okay, okay, okay. Oh my gosh! Tell me Celebrations is not the most fun thing you've ever opened in your whole life. I am so happy. Whoever, like, said to buy a booster case of uh, ETBs out of Celebrations, thank you for your comment. I always appreciate content ideas, but seriously, like Celebration, it's on another caliber. It's not even on this planet in terms of fun. Okay, you ready? What do you think? As I said, four cards. Four cards! The Rayquaza is going to be impossible, but I swear if we do it, we do it as a team. What do you think? Are we going to run out of packs first, or are we going to get the card? It's a hundred boosters, which is a lot. But guys, those Instagram ratios are telling me 200 packs of what you need to complete the whole thing or find those like ultra rare cards. We got Tapa Lele, so already a big mountain we've crossed. Let's keep it going. A Veltool. It's going to sit right at the back. The card that we need, or the cards that we need, are all going to sit right at the back. The Delta Species Gardevoir is... That's a tough one to get. So let's see what we can't do. But I'm confident. I'm so ready. Swing it around. Flying Pikachu VMAX looking good. You go to the side. You're getting in the giveaway pile and Lugia. Getting a lot of these flying... Considering, like, I didn't have Surfing or Flying Pikachu for the longest time, we're getting a lot of those cards. And there's a fair bit of fuller texture on those bad boys, too. One from the back. Swing it around. Here we go. Regular V version of Flying Pikachu. Lugia. Ho-ho. And a Mew EX. I will take it. This one's a 1 in 77 uh, card thing, so I think this one might be the only Mew that we get today. But again, I will definitely take. I love this personally. One of my favorite cards out the set, even though it's not the rarest one. I, everyone loves the Charizard. Everyone loves, you know, the OG Blast toys and everything. But I do have a soft spot. The old school lowercase EX cards, they're just a piece of those dolls. They're beautiful. They're really cool. 
And I just remember having road trips in my car and begging my dad to have enough money to buy like a pack of Pokemon cards to get an EX pool. All my friends would talk about the elusive EX card you could get. I never knew about it. It just brings back a lot of good memories. What in Aunt Jemima happened here? Jeez, the EDB really squished this one up. I wonder if we can break it through the middle then. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, a bit of science right here. This is why Ando went to art school. One from the back. I dropped out of art school after uh, two years, but... <laughs> Lunala, and then... Uh, Cosmog. Dude, I reckon we got 40. Yeah, I reckon there's about 40 packs left. We're getting close, though. We're, like, again, it could be, like, five packs and we've finished everything. Not even. Four packs, we've done everything. Kyoga, and another Imposter Professor Oak. So, there's definitely tears to this. This is on the more common side, your Imposter Professor Oak. And we're going to keep it moving. Any moment. Show me. Hey, uh, Mewtwo EX. I reckon that's a good one to go for. I'm going to tidy this setup in just a second. We might do it in a tick. Let me swing it around. But I just think every single boost is a new opportunity for us to try and get the goods. Either add to the giveaway pile or add to the giveaway booster pile. Okay, up you. There we go. And we'll make this the final one and then I'm going to clear everything off. You ready? <sighs> then you have a clear look at how many packs we got left. Oh, Claydol! There we go. That fan favorite. He's going to love it right now. Let's clean this entire desk off and resume the hunt for the ridiculous ultra rare celebration cards. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, this right here is where you get your boxing gloves on. We are gonna randomly take out packs, I think, because this right here is the only amount of boosters until we finish off the challenge of opening 100 Pokemon celebration booster packs. And get this, one single video. There's the code card. Let's draw, oh, okay, this could be good, this could be good. Zamazenta, already in the giveaway pile, ho ho. And a birthday Pikachu on the... I, it's something about the very first pack. Every time we do it, we always get a good pull. And this right here, it could be Ando's Pikachu. But the next one could be anyone that wins the giveaways Pikachu. Black Star promo. It's got the birthday down there. So you could write the 30th of the 3rd, 1995. But let's put that one there. And let's keep it going. How funny it would be if we already doubled up on birthday Pikachu with this booster? Let's find out. So, you guys know what. We're looking for a particular four cards, so as soon as we can get those, the better, I think. One from the back. Come on, heritage cards. Any moment, flying Pikachu in the giveaway pile. Lugia, and then another Team Magma. This has got to be one of the most common, I reckon. Team Magma's Groudon. Got it early on at the start of the video. Get it again. So, okay. Confetti Field, beautiful Groudon. One of my favorite legendaries. I think even though I played through Sapphire as a kid, like, I love... Don't get... Sapphire, I spent so much time in. Emerald, don't even get me started. I spent so long saving up my money, doing the, like, laundry. I did the lawns. I did everything. And I played Emerald till the cows came home. Like, I did it so much. And Groudon was always one of my favorites, even though I never did uh, Pokemon Ruby as a kid. It was always up there. Can we get... Another Venusaur! Oh, I'm having flashbacks already! This is awesome! So we get a giveaway of Venusaur right here. You guys know the drill. That is so good though, because we've got a Wizard of the Coast now to add to the collection. I mean, like an original three Wizard of the Coast, I should say. That is sick. Okay, got the Venusaur. But I'm also questioning now, because we pulled the Charizard, how is Blastoise not coming out at all? I've only ever pulled one Blastoise, by the way. Considering we've got two Venusaurs in like one episode today. Where did Blastoise go? Is he just not showing up? There's the uh, code card for you guys. And hopefully we get a Blastoise popping up anytime soon. Claydol is... <laughs> I hate to break into that one Claydol fan, but he might be pretty common. Get in the confetti filled Claydol. And if you are the Claydol fan, leave a comment because if you win the double ups today, you'll get not one, but two different Claydols. So it's going to be a fun time for you. And you might want to give, like, some away at school or something when you get it. Okay. Open this bad boy. And let's see how luck goes. Again, have you noticed? Haven't seen any of these, like, EX cards. They are so difficult to try and track down. I mean, we've got 100 packs, guys. It shouldn't be this difficult, but it is. Reshi Ram, and that's going to finish it off. No way. It's just terrifying because that's it. I want to say that's 30 packs. Like, three ETBs and that's it. I want, to, I want to call the EDBs booster boxes in my mind. I keep thinking booster box. Oh, okay, this is good. This is good. Giveaway of the Professor's Research Fuller. That's a slapper. And then... Nah, nah. <laughs> I feel like if I build the pack up, it's like... 
Arceus starts to build it behind the scenes. He's like, I'll give it a good pull. Again. I get those final cards I need for my binder. I give the seal uh, booster packs away. Surfing Pikachu and... Palkia right there. I saw the blue and I was like, Blastoise finally? Or another Shining Magikarp? Couldn't possibly, could it? Okay, rip the door. Okay, okay. Bit of, bit of a funky action. I really, really wouldn't mind a Golden Shining Mew as well. That would be amazing. And it really does show how tough that Shining Mew would be to get. Palkia. And then that Reshiram is going to end us off. Oh, no. <laughs> it is going to come down to the wire. And a, uh, I had a bad feeling it would be the case, but when I got that Tapa Lele, I think my mind sort of changed. Like, Ando, it's possible. But I don't know, I'm getting a bit bit back to the worried side right now. Kyogre Exernius. And another Groudon. Got the Team Magma Goons right there. And let's open up this one. I think we're going a lot from the middle. So if we don't get anything here, I'll go from the left or right. If we get something here, we'll keep going from the middle, I guess. Flying Pikachu once again. One of my favorite V-cards they've ever made. And... You are kidding me! As if we go and double up on the Tapa Lele! It's fantastic because someone at home's getting this like really rare card, but out of anything that we need, oh my goodness! Tapa Lele, dude! Oh, you could have been a Mewtwo EX part, Exodius, anything like that. That's alright, I shouldn't be disappointed at such a rare card. It's a double up for uh, someone at home there. Got the logo, got the confetti. I saw that, like, this has got a lot of sparkle to it, and I saw the sparkle, I got so excited. Okay, let's get you. Let's keep going. And it is on the uh, slightly terrified side. I reckon there's a little bit of sparkle right there. It is a good sign, though. The middle part is starting to come out with the goods. So we got Solgaleo, and then it is... Yes! No way! Another one! We might be able to do this. We are down to three cards right now. God of War EX. Delta Species! I always wanted to do a Delta Species booster box opening on the channel and before the prices went crazy like Logan Paul did all his thing and you know prices went higher than my bank account. Seriously, I had a Delta Species box lined up. I was gonna buy from Leonhardt like a little like DMs. But then like I think Logan Paul when that, all the prices went up I never got to buy the Delta Species box. I had one lined up for the channel and that's probably my biggest regret ever. I never got to open a Delta Species booster box here. If today's video gets like crazy amount of likes, like 30,000 or something, maybe I'll have to go and consider buying one, but it's just so hard to track down. They're very expensive. How good is this card though? Old school EX, Delta, God of War as well. Beautiful texture. I am so happy. This is like one of my last ones I needed for my collection. Okay, we are down. We are down to like the bonkers rare stuff. Rayquaza, Exernius, and Mewtwo. Three cards though. Seriously, once I've got the three, give them the rest away. The so let's keep going. <laughs> it's gonna be such a difficult one. So let's put you to the side. Let's go the uh, code card right there. Swing it around. Another giveaway. Pikachu. Reshiram. Zekrom. And another Imposter Professor Oak. I got a feeling these heritage cards right there, we've uh, exhausted the options. So let's start going from the other middle side. There's the uh, code card. By the way, if you guys are cashing in the codes, please let me know what you get. And keep in mind, like, if you don't get the ones at the beginning... <gasps> yes! Yeah! <laughs> no way! We're down to two! Ladies and gentlemen, Exodius EX has been found! This is the most exciting video ever made on the channel! Like, I kid you not, this is bonkers! Exodius EX! Look at that! Oh! Dude, I've never been this excited over an Exodius EX. Oh my gosh, it's happening. It's happening. Dude, look at that. It's amazing. Look at the rainbow, the confetti on the EX right there. It's gorgeous. Oh, fairy type. RIP. I love you. Okay, let's do it. We've got two cards I needed. Everyone, just, oh my, just massage your face. We just need two cards, guys. Just need the two, and I've finished the whole set. And as I said, today's the finale. Today, today it's gonna end. Is it, like, what would the chances be of finding this, those two? I've even got the Charizard today. It's already one of the best openings you could possibly do celebration-wise. It's all gonna come down to this, isn't it? <sighs> Flying Pikachu, all right, buddy. You go to the side, into the uh, giveaway pile, and a ho-ho. 
every single pack though I get a little bit sad because it's one less that we can give away if we do end up finding the two ultimate chase cards. And if I swear, if I don't find what we're looking for today, what product does Uncle Ando have to open in order to track him down? Because I want to be able to like have one set in the world and it's going to be this one. Where I can, someone goes, oh did you collect celebrations? And not only can I show them my binder and be like, I've got all the cards. Yeah, yeah, whatever, Ando. Maybe you bought, like, that one or that one. I can be like, no. There is a playlist on my channel. And if you go to that channel, you watch that playlist, you will see every single one of these cards get pulled. And so, like, even when I'm dead, you'll be able to literally go back to my channel and watch me pull every single card of Celebrations for the first time on camera. And that's all I'm praying for. And for that to happen, for that statement to be true and that playlist to work, we are hunting for two cards today. And whoever wins this double up is gonna get so many extended up Pikachus, I don't know what you're gonna do with them all. This is it. This is literally all that we have left. Trust me, if you're scared, Uncle Ando is like 10 times more scared right now. Oh gosh. I mean, I'm even like stuffing up the booster pack wrappings right now because I understand that 25 packs left. We're three fourths of the way through, I reckon. Haven't even seen Gold Mew. I wonder how rare that gold- that gold new full lad's gotta be a very rare card to be honest. Because if we haven't seen that one yet, Exernius- I'm oh, sorry. I wish we pulled an Exernius. Zacian V, Cosmog, and then... Kyogre. Where's Blastoise? Come on, I need a Blastoise because we've pulled Venusaur twice. Pulled a Zard. You can't not give us the water type. The coolest dude, Squirtle Squad. My boy. Okay. Open this one. Swing it around. There's the code card. One from the back. Everyone, you think. Just visualize. Visualize Rayquaza. Visualize Mewtwo. All you gotta do, guys. Kyogre? Mm. <laughs> it's like a kick in the gonads. I'm gonna start working my way, I think, from the uh, right-hand side, and we'll work our three oh, work our way through to the uh, to the left. Mew. Very like on the rarer side for the common celebration set and a ho-ho. Oh no, this is not good. Going from the far right. Work our way through here. Final 20 or so booster packs. There you go. And if you made it this far in the video, now is the time to start claiming those code cards because I guarantee they're not getting used. How do we dump? Is it the rug? And if it's the rug, why do they have more Charizards? This is so peculiar. Okay, another Venusaur. I'll take it. Hands down, an absolute slapper. The original three from the Watsy days. But again, that's two two Venusaurs if you're getting the double up uh, giveaway pile. Come on, Heritage Pool. Heritage Pool, let's go. Mew, Kyogre, Aveltal, Exernius. Oh gosh. <laughs> it's pretty crazy. Exernius managed to get two cards one in the regular, one in the uh, Heritage set. That's pretty cool. Imagine if Charizard was in both the slots. Could be freaking out. Extended up Pikachu, Cosmog, Zekrom, and Dialga. Got a feeling I'm going to be seeing a few of that right now. We are closing the gap. We are entering. Oh gosh, the final couple right now. There's the code card. Swing this around. I'm, this, all I'm doing right now is visualizing. Groudon. You're going to manifest the cards that you need. I'm praying we can give away at least four packs, maybe? <laughs> We've already got one good giveaway, but I really, now that I have the idea of giving some booster packs away, I think we can do it. But the chances of us pulling two of the rarest cards in this whole set just seem so slim. But also, this set just pulls things out of its butt. Like, it, any moment we could be getting something. Oh, I ripped the front door off that one. Let's complete... Oh my god. Oh my... Holy Aunt Jemima. There's got to be something in here. I think I even see something. So if this is not a pull, which it's not, I think we got a heritage card. Professor, Palkia, and then... Another Mew! I, I mean, I said maybe a second one, but I wasn't confident. So this is a great news. Okay, I'm adding a Mew to the giveaway pile right now. Dude, look how cool it is. I love this card. I could stare at it all day. Mew's so, like, so cute on top of that. But bro, I'm looking at you right now. Where's your shining cousin? Where's that full gold texture? Haven't seen him at all. I would have loved to say that we pulled both of those. Like, one for me, one for you guys. Oh my gosh. It's down to like the final 15. And Uncle Lando is terrified. You to the side. <laughs> there you guys go. Oh, dude. This one's gonna... Oh, I swear it looked like it was curved. It's all right. Professor's research full lot. Looking good. Gorgeous texture. And let's go. Avelto, Exernius, 
Dialga. That's it. Look at that. <laughs> oh no! How did they get to this? I don't even want to know. Okay. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Open you up. There's the... Oh, I just threw that code across the room. Lunala? Dialga. Cosmog. The energy level's starting to see. My confidence in doing what I thought I could 100% do. I'm starting to panic. The 100 boosters might not even be enough to finish off this set properly. Let me know in the comments who's completed the set. Another one for you guys! The most common heritage card has got to be Team Magma's Groudon, i got to be honest. Maybe even Venusaur as well, because that's ridiculous. But let me know in the comments who's completed celebrations. And don't tell me you did it normally, because if you did, how many booster packs did it take? Like, I don't know what you did. You bought a whole bunch of maybe ultra premium collections, got super lucky. Maybe you bought a stack of like ETBs and like they, they stuffed it up. It just seems like it would be so difficult to try and get everything. And if, I don't know, I feel like you probably would have had to bought the cards that you need. It's probably what I should be doing, like the final two cards. I just want to fulfill the dream of pulling everything on camera. Xerneas, Cosmog, <gasps> yes! No way! Come on! Yes! I did it! I got Jungle Flipping Rayquaza! Ladies and gentlemen! Oh my gosh! We have one card left to go! Oh my goodness! Oh my- I can't believe this! I'm- look how red I am, guys. Oh my gosh! Mega Rayquaza EX has been found! The like $84 card! One more to go! One more card, and I've finished the whole set. Are you ready? Let's go. Mega Rayquaza EX coming in hot. Jeez, it looks good. It's fantastic. I don't actually believe that this happened right now. Physically don't believe it. There's a good amount of packs too to give away if we do find Mewtwo EX. Okay. <sighs> Rayquaza's to the side, guys. That is amazing. I can't believe it happened this late into the opening. We are one card away from a booster pack giveaway. Is it gonna happen? Oh my gosh! Flying Pikachu VMAX. Ho ho. Dude. It could happen any pack right now. I also, like, out of... You gotta think, out of every card that we could be hunting for, we've pulled most of the cards we're looking for. That doesn't happen. Like, imagine we hunted for, for like, the full uh, gold Mew or something. We wouldn't have had it. It's so lucky the way this opening has gone. Like seriously, my luck with celebrations has been something else, I swear. Everyone, it's all you have to think is Mewtwo EX. That's it. That's all I want to hear from you right now. I just want to see it. Come on, it's so possible. I will never have to crack a celebrations pack open again thinking all I want is this one card. A Rocket Zapdos! I'm happy you guys got one. That's fantastic. It's what I needed for my collection. Someone hopefully needs it for theirs. I encourage whoever wins the giveaway as well, host your own giveaways. Like, um, I will announce the winner in the following video about who won this. And I, yeah, I really generally want you to give give your cards away that you don't need. So fill up your binder, do what you want. Um, but it'd be cool for you guys to give back if you do win the giveaway and you have all these doubles because you're going to get more than one of a couple of cards especially Pikachus alright, let's go It's look at that I think that's like 12, maybe 13 packs, which is still an okay giveaway there's still like an ETB's worth oh my gosh, it's so fitting we had to pull the Blastoise and we did it this opening is everything, look at that swell, it's so sick it's like when Jimmy Neutron has a brain blast and he's really got to think right there Last Toys has come through. We are waiting on one card now, and it's not the full up Mew because I think that's going to show up before the uh, flipping Mewtwo EX does, but it's all going to be featured on the recap, guys. The sexiest recap of 2021, without a question. I hope you guys have enjoyed this opening as much as Uncle Ando. I hope you're not sweating as much as me because I am dying. Professor, Zekrom, and then. Every single time I see a bit of like purple, I have a mini heart attack. I have like a bit of a meltdown. There you guys go. One from the back. Flying Pikachus. Whoever wins this giveaway is going to get so many flying Pikachus. <gasps> Another one! Three Rocket Zapdos. I mean, it's pretty weird that I didn't have one until right now and now I've got three of them, but that's okay. Next one. Let's go to Gold Town. Open you up. There you guys go. Hopefully everyone's cashing in the cards. There is a sparkle at the end. 
Okay. Mew, I need your cousin. You ready? Three, two, one, boom! <laughs> That's okay, at least we would have pulled it some way or another. God of War EX Delta Species. There we go. Very, very cool card. We did see it before. So let's pop that one to the side and let's keep it moving. That sparkle is what we, that's like what we want to see though. That's like fantastic news when we see the sparkle light up. Just need it more on the uh, purpley side. Legendary Treasures, I think that Mewtwo EX was from. And we had very good luck with that set. So I hope it returns the favor. Full up, Professor. And then... Diaga. I reckon we're on like the final 10 after this. So the final ETB. Genuinely hope I can give away some boosters. I just want to finish the set. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Mewtwo EX. Kyoga. All right. I reckon this is like the final lot. <sighs> guys, how weird is it that we've opened 100 packs in one episode? I am praying that you guys like today's video. Very hard to uh, <laughs> track down a case. But it's all worth it. Oh my gosh, we pulled so many of these. This is crazy when you get what you need. Okay, Team Magma's Groudon. Definitely going to be on the more common side. It's every single pack. Zamazenta V, Lugia, Ho-Ho, and a Groudon as well. Dude, it's right down to the wire. You don't understand. I'm not even like commentating anymore. I'm, gen I'm like sitting there. Feeling like one of the viewers. Just like every single booster. What's behind the doors? Imagine buying this one at the news agent and you need the one card left in your collection. If you complete celebrations by yourself without buying any like cards, I just wanna, I wanna meet you, pat you on the back, give you a hug. Cause I understand the pain you would have had to gone through to track everything down. Okay. We got that extended up Pikachu, Cosmog, Kyoga, and another Venusaur. Are you kidding me? Are you playing with my Uncle SpaghettiOs right now? Chill out with the Venusaur, brother. <laughs> I mean, I, I, whatever. I don't, I don't care. We're going to be grateful because it's going in the pile. But seriously, one card is all I need. Oh, I don't want to open another product. I really want to make this video the final part of the series. Come on. Come on, you can do it. You're probably all coming out of one, all these packs would be out of the same uh, ETB. Mew, Palkia, Dialga, and another birthday Pikachu. I said you guys would get another one. Congratulations, there you go. Look at that, somebody's Pikachu. Maybe whoever wins it, I'll write your name on one of the Pikachus if you want, that'd be pretty funny. Instead of an Ando autograph, I'll uh, try to autograph your name. Okay. This is it, this is it, this is it. This is gonna be the pack, guys. Come on. Lunala, Aveltal, Groudon, Lugia. Hmm. Okay, another dud pack right there. As I said, I'm guessing this is all out of the same ETB. So we should get a couple more hits. I'm not too worried about not getting anything. Surfing Pikachu. That's going in the recap. Lugia, Ho-Ho, and a Team Rockets admin. We actually haven't seen too many of these at all. I do have one which we got from a previous episode, but it is a needed card. So I might just give this one away because I know this is a pesky one to get, and it's not that fun to search for. Unlike the Mewtwo EX, which is oodles of fun. Bruh. That was sarcasm. All right, I'll put you to the side. I think I see some sparkle. Okay, okay, okay. Maybe it was the VMAX, but Surfing Pikachu VMAX, Lugia, Ho Ho. Okay. <laughs> this is it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, this is the final 10. Jeez, this does not look like 10, does it? There's the code. One from the back. This has got to come through with the goods. Final 10, it gives me more hope. Fresh your ramp. Okay, final nine. <laughs> oh gosh, all right. Open you up. Maybe these codes are having magical stuff. If you get a Mewtwo EX out the codes, tweet me. Because I would cry myself to sleep. Exernius, Groudon. I can see the sparkle on the edge of the card sometimes. So uh, I'm this one kind of going for. Gets me a little sad when I don't see any sparkle and I just see the yellow of a regular Celebrations card. Here we go. Surfing Pikachu VMAX. Looking good. Palkia. This could be something. Reshi Ram. Oh my goodness! Another Venusaur! It's for the recap, but dude, why you. <laughs> That's pretty gnarly. Maybe I'll just throw in the uh, Venusaur rug if you win the giveaway, too. So you might as well just start your Venusaur collection early, little Timmy. Okay. We got Zacian. 
Then we got Cosmo. No, ho ho. Okay. This is the yep, sixth to last one. And then we got the final five. This is the 94th booster. How insane is that? The 94th booster pack. And we've still got one card we're looking for. Extended up Pikachu. Exernius. Another Shining Magic Cup. This time, I think for you guys at home, isn't it? Yeah, this is the giveaway one. Wow, that's fantastic news. Shining Magic Cup again. But wow, this Mewtwo is going to be difficult. Shining Magic Cup. Gosh, it's a gorgeous card. I am so happy with how many good pulls we've got today. It has been such a fun opening. Like, there is not a funner thing to do than open celebrations. Like, come on. This is ridiculous. Okay, the 95th booster. That's what this is right now. The 95th booster of celebrations. There's the code card. One for the back. Mew, Groudon, Kyogre, Exernius. 96. Episode 96 of the Celebrations Booster Pack Opening. Alright, Zassian V. Good news, good news. Dialga. And the Bell Tool. 98. The 98th booster. Then we got 99. And then number 100. That's a weird thought. 98. Professor. Palkia. Reshiram. The 99th booster pack of Pokemon Celebrations. We've nearly opened a hundred packs today. We haven't seen the full up Mew, which would be interesting. Imagine if we get two full up Mews. Oh, look, look, heritage card. There's a heritage card. I can see the sparkle. Could I give away one pack? Could you imagine the meme? Oh, it would be so good. <sighs> Mew. Ho Ho. Kyogre. And then... Oh my goodness, it's another one. It's like a card that we were hunting for, but we've got the third one now. Gardevoir EX Delta Species. Now it is all up to the final one. We are giving away a ridiculous amount of cards to one lucky comment. You won't be getting a booster pack giveaway today, unfortunately. Okay, you know what? If I get on this thing, I'll give away some stuff. I'll find some products to give away. Zip. The 100th Celebrations but There is something there. I don't know how confident I am though. I think it had a bit of black on the board. Or maybe it was a serving Pikachu. Let's find out. Serving Pikachu. Cosmog. <sighs> the 100th Celebrations Pack is a Lugia. Ladies and gentlemen, we end today's epic 100 Celebrations opening with Ando needing only one card. Let's have the almighty recap. Ladies and gentlemen, this rank here is easily one of the best recaps I've ever seen on the whole channel's existence. Like, this is awesome. So on this side, these are all the one-hit pulls that we got. So the first lot, and then this right here are all the doubles that we managed to get today out of 100 packs. Which means there's one comment on today's video that'll win all of these cards right here. So if you want to win those... All you have to do is leave a comment and on the next upload, I'll announce the winner. All right, so if we're going to have a super quick like recap of everything we pulled one off right here, I'm talking, we got the Venusaur, check. We got Gold Star Umbreon, Charizard, Blastoise, Shining Magic Up, um, the Exernius, Tapalele, Mega Rayquaza, Cleffa. It's just ridiculous. Team Rockets, uh, Zapdos. We got the Delta Species, EX, Gardevoir. We literally, I think, like, honestly, everything but Mewtwo EX. It's so good. But the doubles are something else. This is insane. All of the VMAX flying Pikachus right there. All the extended up Pikachus. But then as you come down here, how on earth did we get four Venusaurs? That's got to say something. We also got four Groudons, two Gardevoirs, two Zapdoses, and look at all these V cards. But the kicker is, guys, the three packs in the middle... I found left over. So when I was doing all the opening of all the ETVs earlier, I missed three boosters. So before I show you my binder and what these are like when we sort of finish off my binder, I've only got one card left. Let's see if we can find that final card, the Mewtwo EX. Ladies and gentlemen, this right here is a twist that I don't think anyone saw coming right now. We have a final three. It turns out we only opened up 97 packs. And right now, in the recap, we are doing a bonus three-pack opening to make sure the inside is not the Mewtwo EX. But could you imagine if it is? Seriously, I've never been more nervous in my whole life because we've done, we like literally went through all the packs. We came to the end... And then Arceus came down and was like, hold on, 
I oh no way! I'll give you a second flipping chance! Luxray level X! Oh, we are so close, guys! Now, all the doubles will be going in the double pile and giving away still. Don't worry about that. But Luxray level X already. The final three boosters. Thank goodness we found them. Let's put that at the back. I'm going to sell Galio, and there's the uh, code card. But, oh gosh, I'm literally, I'm so worried. Because I, this could be it. This could be the last ever celebrations we need to ever open in the whole channel. Because there's one card that we need, and I've got everything. But either way, after this opening right here, I'm going to show you guys my binder. I really want to show you how good the collections come along and how it looks with only one card missing. A Veltal. Got that Professor Research. And then we got that Code Card. The final pack. This is pack number 100. Dead set. There is no more boosters. I've definitely looked a little timmy. Don't worry. And let's have a look at what we can't get. Out pack number 100. Let's try and get this one open. Without damaging the cards, and oh, if Arceus is watching, there's got to be a Mewtwo EX right here. Exernius, Kyogre, got the Cosmog, and again with the Professor's Research. Ladies and gentlemen, it was not meant to be, but let's have a bind update. Ladies and gentlemen, as we draw to a close of this absolutely ridiculous celebration opening, I think Charizard and Venusaur want one thing. And that's to see the Unlisted Leaf Celebrations Binder. So let's do it. Let's finish it off with a couple of tears. Because look how close I am to finishing the whole set. I've never done this before in like five videos. But we got the whole regular celebration set right here. All the Pikachus. And look at that. The Golden Mew Shining Card. I can't believe we actually pulled that. Considering we didn't get one today, it shows how rare it is. But Blastoise, Charizard. I, am, I could double up on this card all day. Wouldn't care less. And then we got... Another complete two pages. I'm so happy about this. As you can see, we got the Rocket Zapdos today. Also got Gold Star Umbreon. Shout out to my boy. And we also got the uh, Delta Species Gardevoir. And it's pretty cool. We're giving away a Shining Magic Cup, which is epic. Because I know that's a super hard card for a lot of people to get. But guys, look at it. It's an empty slot. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I, I know, I know, I know. It's tier worthy. Mewtwo EX goes right there. But how lucky, out of any pull right, we got Exernius, Rayquaza, and Zapalele today. Guys, I'm going to need you to leave a comment. Do we do a search for the Mewtwo EX? Let me know in the comment section below.